heat we are all feeling now also impacting local farms and their crops. News 8's Eva Zamaris live at Bishop Orchards in Guilford. And Eva, what are they seeing out there? Good evening to you, Darren. We've learned that this hot weather has actually sped up strawberry season. It's impacting other fruit as well, and this is something that farms all across the state are seeing. At Bishop's Orchards in Guilford. Still berries here. It's been one of their best years for strawberries. It was the best we've seen in a couple of years. But this year, the warmer weather started the season earlier, and this week's heat sped it up even more. The heat has made it a very quick season. It made it an early season and made it end very quickly. Sarah Bishop Della Ventura explains because of this, they're nearing the end of pick your own strawberries for the season. Like you can see the difference of like, the, the berries are passing like it's just and at this point it's overripe and it's impacting other fruit as well. What it's done to us is now all the other fruit is now ripening at a, an exponential rate, a little, little faster than we than we normally see. This is something local farms all across the state are experiencing, including Jones Family Farms in Shelton. Mother Nature's my boss and I can only work with the cards I'm dealt that she's been giving me. Now with a week of heat being dry, it's just kind of exacerbated everything and it's kind of hastened the end of the, the season. As their strawberry season winds down too. Blueberries, it's, it's, it's all pick your own. Jamie Jones says they're looking ahead to blueberry season, which he says is starting about one week earlier than normal. I would expect sometime midweek next week we'll be starting to harvest these. The blueberries are getting there at Bishop's Orchards as well. As these farms continue to navigate what Mother Nature brings their way, they're encouraging everyone to come out and support local farms in Connecticut. Make sure that people are following to say, hey, I don't want to, I don't want to miss the season, and then making sure you come out and support us. We've got to get out there and support the farms and visit them. Call up these farms, follow them on social media. That way you won't miss out on any of these pick-your-own seasons. Live in Guilford tonight, I'm Evan Zamaris, News 8.